everybody! It's good to see you guys. Nivel with the first, stars with the first two. Janaik, thank you so much for resubscribing for 17 months. Pants. <laughs> Hesty, good morning. We ending Kieran, he deserves it. Adobo Big Mac. Oh, uh, Haunter of Astora. Haunter, it's been a while since I've been able to talk to you on my stream. Cool username. <laughs> wow, is that like Tuppins? Hello. Hi, baby. Whoa, it's Legs McGee. Hi, stars. <laughs> Cubbins, nibble, legs. <laughs> it's good to see everybody. I forgot to change my question of the day again. Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on. I was promised it wouldn't be a big deal. Shake my head. So much hate. There we go. I got it. Which Elite Four? I changed it to Trainer. Who is favorite RDR2 camp member? Hosea. Hands down. Hosea or Charles. Charles. Mm hmm. Today's question of the day Which Pokemon would be banned on Twitch for artistic nudity? Lopany. No doubt. She's not wearing a shirt. <laughs> Anthony. <laughs> I love Anthony. <laughs> he has such a great uh, character development over the course of the 60-hour story arc. This is a trap, and I will not divulge this. <laughs> oh, man. Um, I've been um, doing a little bit of streaming in the evening because today, um, I... Toppins and I are going to a birthday party at like 1230-ish, so I'm going a little earlier, but I won't be um, streaming as long, so I guess I better get into it because we're going to be on a time constraint. Can I come? Yeah. <laughs> I think you mean how am I suspicious? I hit pass on all of them. Oh yeah. Let's just jump into it. Let's just let's just get into it. Where's my here we go. Lex, you want me in your game instance to help farm BP? Both a peas nuts. Like, right now? Ate half a bag of marshmallows yesterday? That's very Tuppence coded of you. Tuppence does that all the time. It's kind of like his thing. Hold on. Here we go. You can have that. We are going to do the final battle versus Kieran, our rival from the previous game. I think he's in here. Actually, where is he? Oh, it's here. Okay. At the entrance. Looks like we share quests and rewards. Oh, okay. I won't really be like in your way. I'm just BP farming. I won't say no. Hang on. Let's do that. Load it up. Kieran is not the rival. He can eat shit. My true rival is Nimona. Um, Union Circle. Here we go. These little dorks. Wait. Shuba? Oh my god, the sugar content is wild if you eat a bunch of them. Oh, goodness gracious me. This is too big! I say that every other day. <laughs> there we go. 
You know it. You know it. Form a group. Are you online nibble streams? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mm. Ah. I did not hear that. <laughs> I was never here. <laughs> um, offline? Why doesn't it just... There we go. The excessive marsh upset my tongue and made my heart race. You know, you get to that point where you can't just eat junk anymore. And it's hard to deal with. I think I hit that shortly after uh, starting my career. Um, there was like one time where I had... Oh, here's the link code. Anyone with the link coin code can join. We're gonna steal his Rayquaza. Oh, apparently the... Uh, the Pokemon Home is ready to go. Oh, you finally changed your picture. I'm so happy for you. you Tell me Dark Souls fucking one automatically launches it online, but this new ass game does not. <laughs> this game heckin' sucks with the online, bro. It's Nintendo. I wish the outfits didn't look like that. All right, Nibble, get me some money. I'm putting him to work. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Nibble. All right, let's go back. Who the hell has... Fr <laughs> Wait a minute. What the fuck? Wait. It assumes you're playing with friends in the same room first. <laughs> I see, I see. Who the hell has friends? We're stealing Kieran's spicy sandwiches. That bastard. He's gone evil. I'm scared. Where is he? Oh. Wait a minute. Why are you just standing here? Hey there. Kieran got done, did so wrong in Red Dead Redemption 2. I know, poor kid. I just wanted to, I just wanted to chat. See, he even has the Aegislash scarf motif, and you don't get Aegislash in this, apparently. How's that blueberry Pokedex of yours coming along? Come show me once you filled it in a bit. Definitely come show me if you complete it. I'll be sure to shower you with praise. How many do I need? 142. Pretty good collection you've got going. Lots of different Pokemon in the terrarium, right? It takes serious ca cash to keep the temperatures regulated throughout that whole thing. Okay, so you probably need, like, just need to get it finished. I bet Kieran's... Yeah, I bet Kieran in this is also an Odriscoll. You found five dollars in your bed? You can go out and buy a little ice cream or something. Ready to sign up for your official match? Yes, ma'am. Let me get your championship match set up. It won't take a moment. You said you and Kieran are friends, right? Well, sorta. Yeah. Huh, no kidding. Here's the Dracer take. I liked Kieran better when his hair was down. So did I. He used to be this quiet little guy. Trembled like a leaf. Had all the spies spine of a Wimpod. That's a Pokemon that's known for running away. Drayton based? Yeah, based and Drayton pilled. He'd hide behind Carmine if he so much as breathed too loud. But I tell you what. When it came to Pokemon gat battling, I never saw so much joy in any anyone's eyes as his. But then, out of nowhere, he changed. Now he's relentless, pushes himself, pushes everyone around him. I'm finding a bunch of coins in the floor of my room. I never even noticed them. 
You're like a little coin goblin, a little fiend. Oh, I missed that. I tried but couldn't do it. Guess I've gone soft from the lazy life, so now I guess it falls to you. Sorry, bud. Everything's ready. Yeah, I'm ready. Legs? I just almost read battling as Gatling due to Red Dead, and I love that. <laughs> oh, me? Whoops. Well, it's all up to you now, Legs. Me and the other Elite Three will be cheering for you. This is an official BB League announcement. A championship match is about to begin at the battle court near the entrance to the academy. If you would like to watch the match, please make your way there. The burden is now on my shoulders that are, you know, tastefully covered. I sure hope you're getting all these BP this despite being in this battle. We'll see. Let's fucking kill him. Kept me waiting. I worked so hard for a chance to show you what I can really do, Legs. Yeah, thank you for not being on the Twitch homepage, because holy shit. I put everything into studying and make my Pokemon stronger. Oh, we're having some stutter. I crushed the Elite Four and became champion. Kieran, when you lose today, you better go bald. All that hard work. All of it. I'm... Yep. This is the end for you. All of it was just so that I could beat you right here, right now. Scary violin sting. Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my fucking lord. I know I'm making the right choice, you'll understand that soon enough. You've got Sumner bringing out the ogre now of all times? Ah! <laughs> You're freaking me out, dude. I gotta get out of here, I gotta get out of here. You've got some nerve! <laughs> Is that a frog? Yes, and he's going to die. <laughs> Rest in peace, you stupid frog! Ack! Wowzers! Doesn't matter if the tight match acts work out for you though, I'll still win! Bitch. <laughs> Catch it? I can't. That's not how the rules work. A crit? Serious? Oh my god. Oh my god. How do you like that? See how hard I've trained? Not the kid you battled in Kitakami, huh? <laughs> Little bitch! Porygon Z! Still can't pull off a move! Nah, Peppermint's got it. I think we'll Stealth Rock. Fucker. Oh my god. That's that multi scale. Life Orb? Stop it! Peppermint, no! Come on, Peppermint, get the stealth rock up. Yes! Yeah! The frog would never shoot two under a, at Lone Grove. Your far superior actually toughens. The frog doesn't have the timing necessary. Exactly, exactly. Hmm, we're in a bit of a pickle here, aren't we?
Oh, he's dead. Peppermint's dead. I should have hit Porygon Z. Because now I'm going to go down to Porygon. Unless he set something up? Ice Beam, yep. Oh no. Ah, she killed me! <laughs> Now you fucked up. Grim snarl. Hell nah. Ah, I have croaked. <laughs> Frog pun. Oh, shit. Um... Yeah, we'll incinerate. Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> no! You motherfucker. How am I gonna kill this stupid Grimmsnarl? I know. gonna hit him with the blood moon. What a mistake. Didn't set up reflect. I mean light screen. Damn, Azula. Oh my god. Failed. Okay, that's good. Go down already! How are you still standing after all- I've thrown everything I have at you! Incineroar, Incineroar! Come on now! And Hydrapple. Mine's shiny though, mine's better. Oh, that's fine. Super sweet aroma. Evasiveness? Okay, that's fine. Earth power on Incineroar. I don't need the old me anymore. I've changed and I'll show you I can change again. Okay. Chill, chill. Oh, dragon? Fighting? What the hell? What do you think you're doing? Oh, the citrus berry was burned up. Lucky. Hey, let's go. Oh, it's too easy for a guy like me. Oh. Azula! Fighting? Like, what's the point of that? I think I'll just have to... Like... Power him? Like, just outpower him? We're going to destroy him with the Blood Moon. 
and hydro steam. Let's tear a fairy. Nah. We're good. Blood Moon. Like stream Tears of the Kingdom when? Oh, he's still alive. He's still alive. <laughs> Overkill. <laughs> That's a little much. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I did one Tears of the Kingdom stream. <laughs> what? Huh? <laughs> Oh, there we go. All Nibble's quests are done. Oh my god. Oh no! I lost again! What? He actually lost? Let's go, guys. Yep. That's what happens. Why? This wasn't supposed to happen! No, 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 no! See? This is what happens. Way to go, both of you, that was awesome. Honestly, Crispin, read the room, would you? How do I, wait. Sorry, this is a cutscene. Good match, you two. Too bad about the outcome though, huh? X champion Yeah, it's technically a cutscene. Unless I can count Jessie from Team Rocket. In that case, Nivel. No, that counts. She's a trainer. Look at you, buddy. Way to go. Guess we got a new BB League champion. Haunter, you kind of missed the story, but this... Kieran went on a power... Like a power-hungry phase. And he was drunk on it. He was drunk on that power, that position. He needed to be knocked down a peg to learn a lesson. The Academy's got a prize for people like you who make it all the way to being champion. Here, all yours. Master Ball! I got three Master Balls now. That's fucking dope. I have zero clue what's going on. No, that's fair. That's fair. Hey, Kieran. This may not mean much coming from a guy who couldn't beat you, but... I wish you'd go back to having fun with all this. I get that burning desire to win. I mean, who doesn't like winning? Just don't let the desire burn you to a crisp. It's hard to watch. Come on, let's all go and... Win next time. Come again? I won't lose next time for sure. I'll, I'll win next time. I'll win. Say something or say nothing. Legs, I... Aww. <laughs> Woof. Um, if we might, um, interrupt. Well, first, of course, we want to offer Legs our congratulations for becoming champion. He really is an amazing achievement, something that should be celebrated. But with the way things are now, I'm sorry to say that it does, well, complicate matters. We're having a bit of a hard time knowing how we ought to proceed. Proceed with what? Well, think about it for a moment, would you, you dumbass? If Lex is our champion, then that means she's head of the league club. But she's an exchange student. What is our long-term plan here if she doesn't stick around? There are so many particulars to sort out. About to pull the Pokemon from the sphere that makes his face the principal forgot about? <laughs> I knew it was evil. <laughs> oh, huh, yeah. If Kieran rejoins the Elite Four after having lost the rank of champion, that would push Crispin out of our ranks. Wait, what? Me? That's bad, isn't it? I'd like to hear from Kieran himself what he would like to do next. Kieran. Holy shit. This is a high school anime student council rom-com now? Essentially. This is an announcement for the following students. Yep. Yeah. Miss Briar and some guests would like to see you. Please just proceed to classroom 14 as soon as possible. Oh yeah, we haven't heard from her at all yet. What could that be about? Now's not really the time. Is the screen flashing for you? 
I feel like, hang on. It flashes to the capture card software? Gotcha. Literally, only just right then when you mentioned it. I saw it out of the corner of my eye as it was happening. BB League Champion Kieran, huh? They're gonna need to update that. Drayton, could you seriously not right now? It's just not right, and certainly not kind. Well, we shouldn't leave Miss Briar hanging, or we'll never hear the end of it. Everyone is their own elite. <laughs> could you imagine? Now your good stream looks good. Okay, cool. I'm sure- I'll make sure Kieran comes too, even if I gotta carry him. Alright, alright. Oh my god, Nibble. Can I, like, turn those notifications off? What do you gotta say? Thank you, Legs. Don't worry about Kiki. We should go see what Miss Briar wants. Someone please heal my Pokemon. Oh, let's go to my room. Maybe my room will let me heal. Um, my Discord server disappeared. Excuse me? What? Huh? It's gone! There's an exclamation point. What the fuck? Huh? Check your email, maybe something happened. Did someone hit like... Make private? I hate her fit so much. I- I feel like such a curmudgeon, like I'm so- ugh. Here we are, Miss B. Nothing shown- what the fuck? I'm pleased to inform you that some very special guests are here to see you today. They left for a tour of the school mere minutes ago, but I believe they'll return soon enough. In the meantime, I'll fill you all in on the situation. Please have a seat. Don't mind if I do. These knees are creaking. Oh, please, you're not old enough for that yet. Legs! I heard you were busy battling your way up the BB League. But to think you make it as far as champion, what a dazzling accomplishment. Thanks, I guess. Sorry, Miss Briar, but could we leave all that for another time? What's this thing you wanted to tell us about? My apologies, that was insensitive of me. Let me get straight to today's topic then. I want you all here to join me on an expedition to the secluded and mysterious Area Zero. Area Zero? That's the place in Paldea you wanted to visit, right? You got permission? My main goals are to, are to investigate the terrestrial phenomenon and to gather samples of the crystals present in the crater. But to be honest, I also have one more ambition for this trip. I'm hoping that we can find Terrapagos, the legendary Pokemon slumbering in Area Zero. Discord itself is freaking out. Fluffy's disappeared too? Oh shit, the Omori server's gone. Shadows of Blood Tide is gone. Nook is on. Oh my, everything's, everything is fucking up. Something? Discord? Hack? Hang on. Exclamation point? Server has reached its online user cap? What the hell? Mine's back? Huh. 
This card is freaking out and your server might disappear temporarily. Okay. Oh no, not her. Gita. Okay, but but Rika's here. Whatever her name is. There you are, Gita. I was just getting the kids up to speed. I do apologize for my tardiness. Miss Gita. Huh? Champion legs? I certainly certainly didn't expect to run into you here. Ah, of course, you must be participating in the student exchange program. Legs just got crowned our new BB League champion, too. Your talent is brilliant as always, I see. Truly a wonderful thing. It's probably Lizard Squad hacking the mainframe. Yeah, it's probably a shark chewing on the cable. If you'll be going along, then I suppose that bodes well. Is it alright if I explain the situation to, to the children, Briar? I'm mumbling. By all means. First, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Gita. I am the chairwoman of the Pokemon League in Paldea. More than a decade ago, the Pokemon League provided support for er research on Area Zero, the great crater at the center of Paldea. Once that research was complete, we shifted our duties to monitoring and managing the area. Area Zero is full of mysteries and also danger. Generally speaking, the area is off limits even for research. That being said, recently we had to confront the possibility that dangerous Pokemon could escape the area. There's a clear need for further research, and quickly. But at our Pokemon League, we've had trouble finding capable, capable personnel, not to mention time, to study Area Zero. So, you reached out to me as I've been requesting access to the area for quite some time now. I apologize that we are not better equipped to deal with this ourselves. Blueberry Academy has a wealth of highly skilled trainers and with well-trained Pokemon. And with Champion Legs on, also on the team, I know I could safely initiate a new expedition. This is ex entirely voluntary, of course, but it would be reassuring to have you with us. What do you say? Will you join our little team as we explore Area Zero? I'm in! Splendid. Well said, Champion Legs. Let Rika say something! Uh, I think it's already time- already decided that I'm going. Your support will be very useful as always, Carmine. I appreciate you having- having you on board. What is this blocking? This angle is horrible. I'm criticizing it too much, but seriously. Sorry, but I'll pass on this one. The League Club's a whole mess right now. We need a, my steady hand on the wheel here. Sure, you just can't be bothered to travel all the way to Paldea, can you? Heh <laughs> heh, guilty! I'm curious what our mighty ex-champion is thinking, though. I'm going. If there's a legendary Pokemon there, I want to find it and catch it. This time, I won't let its chance go. I'm going to steal it right from under him. Interesting. Then it's decided. It's too bad that Drayton won't be joining us, but it seems the team will consist of Carmine, Kieran, Legs, and myself. You have my thanks for your help on this matter. Kieran, you're getting nothing. You deserve nothing. I look forward to the great findings that you will no doubt bring back. I'm grateful for the opportunity, Gita. Opportunity, Gita. Leave it to me. My dream of exploring Area Zero is finally becoming a reality. Now, time to prepare. Let's meet by the bridge at the Academy entrance as soon as we're ready. Big cutscene. What up? It's been a while, Champion Legs. Hiya, kiddo! Rika's here, too, at your service. Not gonna lie, I never dreamed we'd be running into you. I see that you're putting your skills to good use and living up to your title as Paldea Champion, even while abroad. I'm doing my best. Ha! Indeed! I would expect nothing less from a talented trainer such as yourself. Yeah, definitely got talent. Lots of talent. But not enough to get you off the hook! You went into the Great Crater without the League's permission, didn't you? Oh shit, I'm in trouble. Don't think you're not gonna get a scolding for that. That's what champions do? Yell at me, step on me! What's that got to do with anything? You can't just go breaking rules willy-nilly! Calm down, Rika. No harm came to her, after all. And besides, we have a good reason to believe that all of Paldea would have been at risk if Champion Legs there here hadn't ventured into Area Zero. Well, yeah, I mean, that's true, but... 
Fine, I'll let you off the hook this one time. You better thank the boss for stepping in. Don't think poorly of Rika, she's just worried for you. Now then, champion legs. This time you'll be heading to Area Zip Zero with official League permission. Only a handful of people know about the incident involving the time machine. Oh, that's great. However, taking into account the dangers of Area Zero, Zero I have elected to inform Miss Briar of what happened, obfuscating certain details. Speaking of, boss, didn't you say you had something to give that Briar person? Yes, yes I did. I'd forgotten about that. Champion Legs, would you be so kind as to take this for me? The Indigo Disc. Here it is. Mysterious disc with an indigo shine to it given to you by the top cha champion. It seems to be tied to Area Zero. A TM or something? Is it, it is a disc that was sent by an Area Zero researcher to an investor some time ago. <laughs> that's, that's the name of the DLC! They said it! I had my investigation team look into it. It is certainly not a TM, nor is it a mere tool for storing data. I honestly have no idea to its true purpose, but I assume it has to do with Area Zero. I figured since you're heading to Area Zero, I might as well ask you to investigate the purpose of this disc while you're there. While she's there, huh? Did you want her to pick up some potato salad on the way back too? Oh my god. I do ask that you return the disc to me if you end up not finding a use for it. There is still much we do not know about Area Zero. I know you've already been to its depths, but please exercise some caution while dealing with the environment and Pokemon there. I go there to train. <laughs> I go there to grind. As a champion, it falls on you to protect and guide those accompanying you. Wish I could go with you too, kiddo, but I've got my own work to do. Do your best down there, but don't push yourself too hard, you hear? Now, please excuse us. Bye-bye. They got that strut. They got that swagger. Team's looking good. Oh my god, Nibble. You got me so many points. Get ready for more BP notif- Yeah, yeah. I'll return the favor. Don't worry. Every time I enter the menu, it friggin... Resets everything. So much easier when I have access to double the quests. Oh, good. Hmm. Look at you go. Oh my god, there's so many notifications. Can I turn that off? Awful quiet. I hope he's okay. He was so bad out of shape when he lost. Area he zero, right? Come on, let's go. I want to get started. Are you ready to travel to area zero legs? Yes. Can't believe I lost a fourth time. Yeah. yeah. Yo, Amber! On that watch streak. Let's go. Good to see ya. Splendid! We're finally ready to set off, then. Are you two feeling alright? Well enough to travel, at least? Well, I'm... I'm fine, anyway. Yeah, me too. I've had time to calm down. Oh, well, that's good. I'm fine. I know what I have to do now. I'll find this legendary Pokémon in Area Zero, no matter what it takes. Okay, that's the spirit, Kieran. Briar, you are mi are you are misreading the situation. He is obsessed. How you doing today, Amber? How'd your doctor's appointment go? Come on, Dragonite, take us home.
Ah. Briar, you should hold Kieran back five years in a row as punishment. I think that would be funny. <laughs> I'm, we made it. I'm, I'm finally here. She's crazy. She's evil. It's Area Zero, the place I've dreamed about for years. Look at her. Look at the look in her eyes. Wowzers. My tendon is torn, but it's sprained. Her husband from... Oh, no. Uh, isn't torn, but it's sprained or has damage. Oh, dear. They're putting you... They're putting you through it, Amber. Yeah. So, you've been here before, right, Legs? Yeah, my friends. Friends, huh? I guess. Could be worse. I mean, yeah. It could always be worse. You could be lost in the desert. 200 degrees. I don't remember the rest. <laughs> Eek, you scared me. Honestly, you're too big to come popping out like that. Er, whatchamadon? Uh, yeah? So you came here with legs back then too, huh? Oh, you must be that Pokemon that was reportedly first discovered in Area Zero. I'm very intrigued by this specimen, but alas, it's not what we're here for. Your girlfriend broke her leg recently, so, I mean, when you're directly comparing to someone who broke their leg, yeah, it could, it could be worse. It could be worse. <laughs> I'm very... Oh, yeah. All right, we're here to get to the deepest depths of Area Zero. Don't worry, guys. You can warp there. It's easy. See what's even deeper... Deeper down than the Zero Lab? Heath mentioned in his writings that he fell from the depths to someplace even deeper. Doesn't the depths imply he was as deep as he could get? Yes, it's quite curious, isn't it? However, Heath also were, wrote that he was utterly unable to recall how he got down there. If his writings are to be, to be believed, there must be an entire uncharted space below Area Zero. Well, either way, we should start by making for the Zero Lab down in the depths. You should take the lead, Legs. Okay. Uncharted reference? Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, here we are. Now it's saying I got my prize money. I'm just gonna warp. Well, I hope you guys feel better soon. I hope you guys make a speedy recovery. Oh, I already read this. A thousand BP? We're going to upgrade the biodiversity in no time. Niv Niv caught a sand true. Amazing. Sheesh, I had to reset because Tuppence is too powerful. Oh, like your comp your whole computer? This is a good spot to get shiny uh great tusks. That's where I got mine. Let me show you. That was like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> I keep hitting the pause menu. See, look at him. Isn't he a nice big boy? What if I just like stay here and let the notifications go through? It doesn't matter. I'm out of here. Where are we going? Here. No, not here. It's been a while. I don't... Oh, no, wait. This is the door, right? I guess not. Ow. 
Yeah, Hunter. Amber's been hanging out with us the past few days. It's been really nice having her. Up there? Or... I don't remember. Can't believe Crystal Caverns from Dark Souls 1 <laughs> stole this zone out of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Shake my head. <laughs> She's lying on a menace. No. No, it's been a pleasure. Isn't... Wasn't there something at the bottom? Where am I supposed to go? Fear me, damn it! You can't get me. I'm very strong. I beat Melania. Am I supposed to, like, walk down or something? Okami stole it from Crystal Factory. Okami didn't steal. Everyone's stealing from Okami. <laughs> <coughs> I died to a shield bro and his wolf in the first area. In Dark Souls? Or Okami? Or Kirby? Perhaps Kirby? Elden Ring. Elven Ring's a good game. Despite what Nibble would say, Nibble hates Elden Ring, even though he beat it. You want to like it? You don't have to like it. Like, I don't... What's my goal? Where are my quests? If you're talking about the tree sentinel, he's literally there to teach you to go get more powerful and come back later. Oh! Oh, right! You're right. The guy on his horse? Hmm. Next to the castle thing, you pass the church and the traitor guy. Hmm. Struggling to remember. That was so long ago. When I played that. Hang on. My allergies are going crazy. You know, just... Eh. No one... Good early, early level farming area. Hit that site of grace and talk to Melina first. There's too many characters whose name starts with M in that game. And it pisses me off. <laughs> Is it just in one of these buildings here? Bro. <laughs> there's Melania, there's Melina, um, Mikalash. He's Bloodborne. They should be named Melvin instead, then it would finally be a good game. Fight the M section of the phone book. <laughs> Hang on. I need these. Look at him bounce. Good job. I love this guy. He's so cute. 2000 BP. Let's go, Nibble.
And we'd both earn it, so I'm just getting free BP. Yeah, it's epic. And you're just hanging out having fun. The lighting makes me think everything is shiny. We help each other, yeah! I mean, we're gonna need tw at least 12,000 points to upgrade all the biomes. Here it is! Oh my god. I forgot all about this. Cut scene, cut scene. Whoa, this place is insane. It reminds me of the crystal pool. This is the Zero Lab, I take it. The structure's exterior matches Gita's description, at least. So this is the deepest point in Area Zero? Nope. Well, yes and no. This is the deepest point that the Area Zero expedition managed to reach long ago. You know, I've been told that the lowest level of this laboratory contains a mysterious room whose purpose is entirely unknown. Gita Thunberg? <laughs> it's time to roast some alt-right fucking bitches on the internet. So, you're saying we should head inside this Zero Lab? Gate's closed, though. Huh? Oh, you're right. We got to disable the lock. Hmm, wowzers, this feels like a spy movie or something. Way cool. See, he's coming back. What? I didn't say anything. See, he, it was a facade all along. Well then, can we count on you to unlock the gate legs? Yeah, you got it. Oh my god. Hi there, Legs! It's me, Serato! Seems like you're really digging into those barbecues. I'm going to see to it that you start receiving advanced quests. I think you've earned it. Don't worry, I'm pretty sure you can handle them. Good luck, I'll see you around. Hope it's a smooch fest with AI Sada. Oh, please. Let me smooch. Access revoked due to prolonged inactivity. Entrance locked. Put the disc in. Something wrong with it? Yeah, you got me a lot of BP. It opened before though, right? Is there some extra stuff I'm missing? Last time you went through a series of steps to unlock the gate, and the professor was also there to guide you from the inside. Beep boop. Indigo disc detected. Yeah, here we go. Huh? It's talking! In insert indigo disc for greater access privileges. Relax, it's just one of those computerized voices. Voices, it's not any different than a TM machine. Oh, Gita gave you a mysterious item before we departed, did she? You think that's it? Yeah, no, sh no shit. Go on, likes, do it. You have my permission. In you go, disc. Get in there. Yeah, no one uses the uptime command, Hesty. Because you can easily see how long I've been going for. Ooh, elevator redirected to area zero under depths. Okay. Hesty time! <laughs> Look at that, it opened. Let's head on in. Yeah, it's safe. Hang on, let me change the title. Because we're not killing Kieran anymore. We have to go deeper.
Follow age. Oh, I don't have that set up. Uh, if you go on my about section, like about me page or whatever on my Twitch profile, you can see what commands I have set up. Actually, do I have... All right. Finally, if you forgot to get the one booster energy that was here, you can finally pick it up. It's way too dark in here. I just smacked my head on something. That's because you're just running around without any idea where you're going. Wow, Kiki. Sounds like someone's finally breaking out of their funk, hmm? Shut it. Where's Miss Briar, anyway? She's busy, busy rummaging through, like, a whole stack of documents over there. Aren't those someone's private photos and stuff? We probably shouldn't be looking at all that. Huh? You're awfully considerate all of a sudden. They're gonna see the dead robot. Wish Kieran died. <laughs> oh my god. Miss Briar, look, in the elevator, maybe you can take us further down? You wanted want it to go down, right? Down, you say? Um, I go down? Yes, sir. Oh my, did you use this elevator last time to reach the mysterious room I mentioned earlier? Yeah, sure did. How exciting! Well, we've no time to waste. Let's go down. Yeah, Amber, oh, I love that. That's me, for real. <laughs> Thick. Who's that from? Thick. Oh, yeah. Thick mommy. Um, that's epic. <laughs> this elevator just keeps going further and further down. How wonderful. That's what elevators do. <laughs> you know, it's moving pretty fast, actually. It almost feels like I'm floating. What if Kieran just, like, got motion sick and threw up in the corner? That panel we used to unlock the gate. Didn't it say something about where the elevator goes? Now that, that you mention it, yeah, something's about an elevator being redirected, right? As far as I know, there is only one elevator inside the Zero Lab. So the panel must be referring to the elevator we're currently inside. Oh my god, are you stupid? What if you went bald? Me? It could happen at any time. Where indeed? She's freaking me out. I did that. Not by choice. Hmm. Leg's hair falls off midstream. Why are you speaking this on me? It's okay. Yeah. Oh my. Oh my goodness! Oh my god! So what? Are we under area zero or something? The crystals! According to my data, our current position is far deeper than where we last were. She's freaking out. Could the elevator have taken us even further down than its previous destination? Yes! Oh my, you stupid woman. Harry Zero was already a lot to take in. It's Seat the Scaleless, bro. If I go back up now, there'll be a treasure chest with an epic sorcery. Hey. <laughs> What's all this stuff? I was attacked by a goblin and ate my hair. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Oh, a lovely little goblin! A hair goblin! This is a report written, written by the esteemed Professor Sada. Uh, Terrapagos is the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Its body has become crystal, protecting it from hostile outsiders. It appears that rousing it will take some time. In this cavern, I have witnessed a terrestrial phenomenon occurring in a way I've never seen above ground. Terrestrialization that appears to hold the power of every known type. I have dubbed this terror type the stellar type for now. 
Why are they just telling me this in advance? What is this about a stellar terror type? Brilliant, absolutely marvelous to think there was such so much that he didn't write about. The documents are a veritable treasure trove and we've only just begun our expedition. It's really good storytelling, okay. I wish they would have revealed that to me. Like by seeing Terrapagos and then it becomes stellar type. I don't know how she gets so excited in a bizarre place like this. Whoa, is that guy from Yu-Gi-Oh? Yes, this is Yami Yugi. The hid legendary Pokemon Terrapagos. That's the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Come on, let's hurry up and go further in. Gold, it's good to see you. I still haven't got my fill of these documents, but okay, let's go. Don't worry, there's time. Let's discover the truth with our own eyes. Stay on guard, everyone. Is that Nintendo Switch Board Games Champion? Yo! Gold Thunder? The Champion? What? What? What is this? It's like a crystal trying to be a flower. It's completely blocked up the path. How do you know it's a path? Not going any further with this in the way. What about Wachamadon? That Pokemon you ride on couldn't it smash through? Let's give it a go. Hold on, hold on, please hold on. This is quite likely a manifestation of pure terrestrial energy. We have no idea what might happen if we try to try to destroy it with brute force. Okay, so what do we do then? Hmm. Hi, gold. Oh my god. This Lamora? There are Pokemon all the way down here. And what's going on with this one? It seems to be charged with some kind of strange... See, if they had just shown us this cutscene... Get back, you know you're in... no good in a battle, Miss Briar? Kiki, no legs, you should handle this. Off I go, the protagonist. Mora! Go, Summersby! That's a type of apple cider brand. What am I supposed to do? What does this mean? What on earth is that energy? It, it couldn't be! Level 78. Earth power? Okay. Oh, my strategy. <laughs> Maybe I should take that off. <laughs> That's a lot of terraforms. I don't know what it means. Acid armor? It's not gonna save you. From the beast, from Brother Bear. Can I catch it? No, I have to kill it. So, does it mean like that rock gem was stab? It got the boost from Terra? Good work, legs! Oh, okay. Whoa, it disappeared! Even though it wasn't like a rock Terra... It's just like in that report we found earlier. We got a BP quest we can do together. Make a four-star sandwich. Okay. That means it must have had the stellar Terra type. What is- what's that all mean? Wait, was that supposed to be the so-called hidden treasure we're looking for? No. I don't think so. Yeah, it's slumbering in crystal form. No. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that Glamora was actually Terrapagos. The only way to know if it was the hidden treasure or not is to keep going. Come on. 
Well, Nimble, well, we can do that after, if that's okay. Cause I'm kind of, I'm kind of doing something right now. <laughs> that's so mean. Nibble, I'm fucking busy, okay? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, look! Stellar Terrace, we got 10? Okay, alright. So we can just give that to anyone we want. Cool, cool, very nice. Hmm. Or I can pop off a solar beam if I want. What is that? Oh, it's just carbing. Okay. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. Ah! I didn't even see you there. You know, not gonna lie, my dude here, one of my favorite new designs from this gen. Hydrapple is Pog. Oh my god, 3,000? I can- I can get Totodile! It's Worms, it's a Hydra, it's an Apple. I love Apples, you guys. Come on. It's so me. And the design of the dragon is really well done. All my hard work, Nibble. Thank you very much. Look! Noivern. Okay, so there's a guy over here that we have to kill. Oh, 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 oh. What are you doing? Get up. Ice? I'm looking for treasure. This is literally that level from Dark Souls 1. Ah. Flare Blitz. The Crystal Caves. If there is an invisible floor, Pokemon has stolen. Again. Alright, bitch. Come here. I will destroy you. Let's fickle beam. Well, he might kill me. Pickle beam. Roost? Okay. <laughs> so, just the one head is 80 base power. And that was awesome. You die. <laughs> you die. Miss. Man! That's epic. I'm so chuffed about that.
Hang on, hang on. Um. Pizza. What the boys followed you? They want your pizza. <laughs> Very cute Tuppence moment unraveled behind me. Guys. Tuppence is epic. Well, you. You're welcome. I keep saying that, but it's true, it's true. And funny, and handsome. <laughs> that Pokemon called Karidon, right? Boy, it can really jump! We're on a roll, let's keep moving! We? Summersby is the one doing all the work. Oh. Ah, uh, another one. Allow me. Oh. Oh, where is it? Oh, I see. Little tunnel this way. I'll have to remember to go back there. Oh, uh, 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 excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, come on. You guys know how I feel about caves. But at least it's pretty, right? At least there's practically pretty crystals. And look at all these Terra Shards. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that great for us? Hi, Rodrigo! Good to see you! Pecan's gonna be so confused. <laughs> nah, he'll be fine. Jump off the wall, please. Thank you. Oh my god. What happens when you get three out of three? Caves. I love navigating caves. Me too. Come here. Bzz Oh my god, it's spinning around. That's cute. Earth power. Why did you use it twice? Hooray! <laughs> we win! You know what? Um, I actually have, uh... There's, a uh, What's it called? Fluttermane that I have? I didn't realize that Fluttermane only learned Moonblast at level 83. Damn, she screamed! She's so far away, she would have had to really holler to get that to me. Hang on. 
Here we go. He sh I should put this guy in my party and get some experience. Oh my god. 385, that's a lot of HP. We love to see it. Oh my god, Nimble, how many points do we have now? Okay, 2,380. Okay, there's that secret area that opened up here. Hey, let me up. Sorry we have you doing all the work. We really appreciate it, Legs. Now then it appears the terrestrial energy around us is growing more dense the farther down we go. The goal is 12k. Okay. Nah, they're okay. The notifications are fine. There's just no way to turn them off. Oh, 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 oh. Secret, secret. I almost missed that. Aw. Full restore, max elixir. Oh my god, I think something's gonna happen down here. <laughs> Beldum. Yeah, Max revives. Sheesh. You caught you caught a Beldum. I just got a notification for it, that's all. <laughs> I thought you saw one down there. You're like Beldum! Nibble, if I- oh. If I ever catch a shiny Beldum, you know I'm throwing it your way. Cause I already have one. Oh. I really sank in there, didn't I? Another Sandy Shocks? Okay. Oh, wait. That's a tree. And that is actually garganical, not not sandy shocks. Look at the pretty tree. Touch me with your big fingers. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yesterday, uh, with such a bunch, did so many monsters steal spawns there. I mean, it doesn't help that you're, um, you're also. Wait. It's a shame because in Pokemon Violet, like, that is the exclusive. The Steel Sandshrew is the exclusive. So if you had Scarlet, you would have an easier time. Your fate was sealed when you bought Pokemon Violet, which is insane. And you, there was no way you could have known.
Oh, level 69, baby. Ooh. Oh, nice. Nice. Your turn to call over legs. Maybe she'd rather have you do it. Quit your blabbering, just do it! Hey, the path opened up, we can keep going! Give me this branch. Give me this. This is important and I want it, I know it is. Oh. I mistook the LP for the BP. Yeah, because I only have 2,470. Man. We do be out here. Benefiting off of Nibble's labor. This feels like we're all relying a bit too much on her is all. We should keep going. Can you fucking swim on a dragon? I don't think so. Gah, he's so stubborn. You two are simply dazzling as always. So you know, we were also fending off wild Pokemon while you were away. <laughs> so me and my team are just about spent. Sinistra's all I've got left, so if something happens, you better save me. Would you like this Max Revive I found on the ground? Sheesh. Should we... It doesn't make sense that you can't have a picnic down here. I'll save you any time. My Terra Orb, I think it's reacting to something? You're right, mine is too. I'm picking up a truly astounding level of terrestrial energy. It sh seems to be coming from in there. Are we finally at the finish line? The hidden treasure! Where do you think you're going? Oh, I can't wait another second. The truth behind this scarlet book is so close now. Well, now you too! Those two sometimes, I swear. Oh, let's go. How y'all doing? Ooh, pretty. It's more crystals. Where is it? I must capture it. What is this place? The vibes here are on a totally different level. The hidden treasure, where is it? See? 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 He's crazy. He's obsessed. They're carrying up ahead. There's something among those pillars. Oh, okay. Just a little gem? A brilliant diamond, perhaps? The stone's the hidden treasure? Give me a moment, I just need to check something. If I can get the hidden treasure of Area Zero, I can finally beat legs! Oh my god. Kiki, you're still going on about that nonsense? Shut it, sis! Legs has everything I have ever wanted! She's got strong Pokemon, she can go anywhere she wants, and she can be friends with anyone! I've loved Ogre Pond since forever ago, but even Ogre Pond chose her over me! But Kiki, you did your best too! Even you, sis! You were being all nasty towards her at first, but then BOOM! You were like best friends in no time! I, well... I've got nothing! I worked so hard, and for what? I still lost in the end! This is all I have left now! Found it! The crystal is definitely what we're looking for. Go on, Kieran, pull with everything you've got. Show us the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Briar. <laughs> Briar. You are not paying attention. <laughs> oh. It's dead. Yay, I got it. There's no doubting it. The crystal must be Terrapagos. Oh.
Oh. Look at him. Aw. Yay. Its cry is the sound of terrestrialization. That's so cute. I love him. Oh my god. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're mine. Oh my god. Okay. Here, you little bitch. That was Terrapicos? You caught it, right? Finally! Very well done, Kieran! The fact that you brought along a Master Ball tells me you were well prepared for this. Now I can study Terrapicos whenever I want, but there's no time like the present. Think you can give us a little demonstration of Terrapicos' power right now? Well, you heard her, Legs. I'm also itching to see what Terrapicos can do. Get ready so we can start. Um, okay. What the hell? He backstabbed that fucking turtle. <laughs> Are you ready? Sure. Imagine going to jail and instantly being put into a fighting pit. Imagine being like hibernating in your crystal form. Yeah, the turtle wanted me. I hope you've braced yourself. This time, I'll definitely beat you, Legs. Alright. There he is! Go, Terrapico, show Legs what you're made of! Terra Shift? Oh! Here it goes! Hey, look at that! Terrapagos, the indigo disc. So this is the hidden treasure's true form. This, With this, I can win for sure! Zen headbutt. You're an idiot. I'm going to destroy you! <laughs> Legs used AK-47. I am about to hit him with <laughs> the AK-47 beam. I flinched, and I couldn't move. You're pissing me off, bro! Thank you, thank you. It only knows Zen Headbutt. It's distorting type matchups? <laughs> you done! Critical hit. How can you get critical hits even at a time like this? What are you, the hero of the story? Yeah. Terrapagos' power should be far greater than this. Could it be we're missing something? Good job, Summersby. All at attack. Die! It's missing the legs touch. Exactly. That's right. He sucks without my power. I like his beard, though. I like the design. Aw. Why? I thought if I just had Terrapicos, if I had the hidden treasure of Erezerio, it, it would make me stronger. No, you dumbass. I thought it'd let me beat legs. Kiki, that's enough. It's time to stop this. No, something's not right. It's terrestrial energy so is far too low. Not to mention the fact that it looks different from the illustration in the Scarlet Book. So Terrapicos isn't the hidden treasure of Area Zero? Then I don't want it anymore. 
I'm sure it is. We must be missing something. A way to transform it into the treasure. Of course, Terrapagos is made of terrestrial energy. Kieran, you must terrestrialize Terrapagos this instant. If my hunch is correct, Terrapagos will re resonate with the energy from your Terra Orb. And the hidden treasure will finally reveal its true brilliance. Got it. Actually, the Pokemon has to choose its master. Yeah, that's kind of what's happening here. Uh-oh. That doesn't seem good. I knew it! The Scarlet Book was right! Terrapagos in its fully awakened form! This is the hidden treasure of Area Zero! She's... She, she's... I'm, I'm about to cook her. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god. He's dead. <laughs> oh, things are getting out of hand, Kiki. You should return Terrapagos to its ball. Okay, come back, Terrapagos. Nope, you fucked up. Huh? It won't go back inside. Why? Uh oh. Damn. This is getting intense, boys. Million dollar ball just destroyed like that. Its energy output is going hair haywire while all in serious danger. Sorry, kids, but please, you need to stop Terrapagos. Come on, Kiki, you need to do something too. We've got to get Terrapagos under control. No, this wasn't supposed to happen. This is all my fault. Uh oh. I need. I should have brought me to. Hey, thanks. <laughs> oh, some delicious tea. Terra Starstorm? PK Starstorm! We're fucking dead. Oh my god. He pissed off the baby when he tossed it on the floor. <laughs> That's why I woke up. Hi, Prince Dave. He broke the Master Ball. <laughs> he shouldn't have done that. Come on, Summers B. I can't terrestrialize. Okay, two more attacks. Let me nasty plot again. Damn, Sinistra. Oh no, this isn't good, it's just too strong. I'm gonna kill him. Fickle beam. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Summer's Bee is thrilled to bits. Hit him again. Oh, I avoided the attack. Great. All out! Oh, man! Use Terrestrialized Pokemon to strike back.
I'm about to hit him with the eight. I'm about to hit him with the Glock. I'm about to hit him with the Oppenheimer. I'm about to hit him with that War Thunder. Oh my god. That did way more damage that time. War Thunder baby, I'm about to drop some classified documents on this fool. Seriously? Hey! Oh, okay, okay. You can't just do that. It absorbed the energy? Bro. Change its type? What type is it? Legs is doing all the work. You need to get in there and battle, Kiki. It's no good. I'm useless. Yes, you are! I'll kick your ass, dude! Oh, it's water type now? Oh, oh my god, oh my god, he's dead. He's fucking dead. Dirty, so. Hmm. Should I bother setting up? Let's just hit him with the Ivy Cudgel and see what happens. Oh, yikes. Well, there goes my Sturdy. My sturdy hasn't broken, so... It's fine. I'm not quite sure what type it is, but I'll use Horn Leech. Does it only have Zen Headbutt left? Oh my god, oh my god. Oh. Terrastalize. Let's hit him. My defense rose, though. Might be good. Might be useful. Oh my word! Surely you can't keep doing that over and over, though. He legs is in trouble. You need to help her. But I can't. I can't help anyone. Can you get over it, please? Let's do it together. What? Here he goes. 
I miss you, Nimona. There we go. What type is it now? Prince Dave, thanks so much for following. Oh, okay, I'll help too. Better late than never, I guess. The two of you need to clean this whole mess up. I will. Thank you. <laughs> I will. Thank you, Father. Mira. <laughs> the horse is here. The horse is indeed here. Not gonna lie, whenever it comes to these in-story battles, I always kill my <laughs> my partner's Pokemon. Ooh, ooh, okay, okay, okay. Let's do a swords dance. Cause that did nothing. Oh no. <laughs> Prince Dave going with the the audio redeems. Super effective. Is it water type? I'm horn leeching. <laughs> yeah. Hey. This is good. This is good. If Hydrapple dies, does Kieran have another... Does he freak out again? Get him. I'm rooting for him, honestly. Ooh, yikes. Okay, he's got two Pokemon then. He's got his team. We get to see it twice in one go. And my defense rises again. Pretty good, pretty good. Just for the story beat. Ah, oh, it didn't work. Ah, oh, he's tuckered out. It looks like it can't absorb any more energy or put up another barrier. Time to attack! Time to end the C2. You have got my permission to go all out. I don't know what type it is, so I'll just Ivy Cudgel. If I have a Beast Ball, use it. I, You know what? I think I will. Might as well. Thanks for reminding me. Use a premier ball. Maybe it'll go inside a ball now. Cat, don't catch. I know I can count on you legs. You got this. There we go. Why not? It'll look really good in the beast ball. It's just gonna be sitting in my inventory collecting dust, so.
Let's go. Yeah, for these, you want to use a special ball for sure. Is it over? Is everyone okay? Yep, how about you? I thought you were evil. Sorry. <laughs> I'm fine, thank you. Perfectly unharmed. I let my obsession lead you all into a very dangerous situation. It's simply inexcusable. I'm so sorry, everyone. Use a moon ball? It's my favorite ball. Moon ball is really nice. You should be. You're completely fixated on this terrestrial stuff. You gotta keep your obsessiveness in check. You're changing your walking weights terror type from water to stellar. So, like, what is the benefit of, of stellar type? Do you just get stab on every move? I messed up, too. I looked up to legs for so long. I wanted to be like her so, so badly. I didn't know what else to do. But I guess I just don't have an enemy to be like her after all. Finally, finally I can let it go. You're really cool, too. Just please put your hair back down. But, I just... Wah! Oh, it's tough. I swear, I've got such a silly younger brother. You finally let it go. Stellar Terra Blast looks super sick. I gotta check it out. Oh, you two must have been so scared. But you all shone brilliantly just now. You were truly dazzling. In the end, our legs even managed to catch Terrapagos. These ten-year-olds have too much pressure to bear. Stellar type is simultaneously all types in no time. In regular battles, it gives a stab boost to any move, though only once per type. Okay, so if I, if I had, like, Solar Beam and, I don't know, uh... Flare Blitz. I could give those two stab, but then if I tried to use Flamethrower, it wouldn't work. Time to head back to Blueberry Academy. Ooh -ah. Ooh -ah. Yeah, have a good cry about it, pal. Yeah, it's been a rough day. Finally home. I need to get in touch with Gita. No scratch that. <laughs> oh, I missed what she said. Hey, Legs? Look, I know I caused a lot of trouble for the Lee Club and anyone. Everyone. I wanted to give everybody a proper apology, including you, Legs. I'm so- I'm sorry. And uh, I guess what I'm trying to say is... I want to make things right. So do you think... We could start over from zero and be friends again? The rising sun shines upon us! Vive Japon! Propaganda. Little something in there for ya. Oh, there we go. All done. There's the story mode. You have the Pokeball Fade haircut for my guy? Pokemon Sun remake confirmed? Oh my god. We need X and Y first. Or Nibble's gonna riot. <laughs> Who's the singer for this? Ed Sheeran? We need black and white first? I mean, yeah. I wasn't a big fan of the new haircuts, Dave. Give us black and white. Yeah, give us black and white, come on. There's already a Pokemon It's called Ultra Sun. <laughs> That's true. For new gens. 
They got Ed in this? They had Ed, Ed Sheeran sing the other, uh, uh, friggin' end credit song. The base game end credit song. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Audio Jungle. Audio Jungle. I can't skip it. Uh-oh. I'm gonna get in trouble, aren't I? I can't believe Hesky is missing legs doing Audio Jungle. People really like that, and I don't know why. <laughs> but I, you know, way she goes. I'm on the lookout for the singer. It's amazing, and we love you. Love you guys, too. Conductor, we have a problem. What's the trouble? Audio jungle. What's going on? Yeah, what's what's the tree? What's the tree? Also, I wanna get the the Raikou. Oh come on. Come on, let's go. Producer uses conductor as their tag. Oh! Oh, gotcha. I totally missed that. Um, fucking producers. <laughs> Sorry. I need 200 Pokemon in the decks for a quest to get... Roaring Thunder? Ah. <laughs> okay. Well, in the complete decks? Because I've completed, like, both Pokedexes. Or is it the uh, Indigo Disc? The Blueberry Pokedex? Yikes, dude. Yikes. Celestial Remix by Toby Fox. Oh, that was the Ed Sheeran song. Toby needed some money. You know, he needed some money. I talked to Perrin in the terrarium. Oh, okay, okay, gotcha. We can get that done off screen, I think. Because I'm gonna be leaving soon for a party. You don't know where she is? Um, Perrin's at, like, the first area in the terrarium. Oh, okay, there we go. Isn't that nice? Whew, what a day! Let's see what she got to say to me. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey, Legs, glad to see you. You're feeling rested and recovered after a big adventure down in the Underdepths? Yeah, I feel fine. Okay, I will. Youth really is an enviable thing. I'm still feeling all wrung out despite having been back for a while now. But on to why I called you here. Since our return, I've been writing up everything we discovered on our expedition. Hard honestly, I've hardly slept. 
I've obtained Gita's permission to turn it all into a book, but don't worry, I'll, I made sure to skip a few details and omit the names of those involved. So voila, a proof copy of the book. Freshly delivered from my publisher just for you. Whoa, that was quick. <laughs> okay. I behave recklessly in the underdepths. I don't know what we would have done if it weren't for you. You truly deserve a copy of this book. I just hope it's sufficient as an apology. Yes, that's right. It's behaving just like Kieran and Carmine's orbs. It might be because your orbs are directly exposed to the energy from Terrafagos. Ever since the Underdeaths, they've been able to terrestrialize their Pokemon without charging their Terra Orbs. Yeah, let's go! The Terrarium Core that hangs from the ceiling of the Terrarium? Up until now, I've been keeping it topped up from a mister of Paldean soil and water from the Crystal Pool in Kitokami. Uh, that's how I've been able to stabilize the terrestrial phenomenon on our Academy grounds. But the other day, I tried adding crystals I collected to the Underdeaths to that mix, and it caused the property of the Core to change. Pokemon shining in rainbow colors have started appearing all over the terrarium and have the Stella Terra type. My research into the terrestrial phenomenon is shining brighter than ever. Okay. okay, yeah. Grants a boost to moves, but only once per move. After you use a move, no other move of that same type will get the boost. In terror raid battles, all moves will be boosted without limit. Oh, shit. Man in a blue suit was looking for you over by the entrance to the academy. Sounds good. I'll, I'll check that out, Dave. Okay, alright. Let's check out Terrapagos. There he is, Stellar. Cute. Earth Power Water Pulse. Uh, okay. Hardy. Oh, rock polish? Well, it'd be too, it, it would be a little too crazy if it had shell smash. It'd be a little insane. It'd be a little broken. All right, let's talk to... The Steel Girl. Legs. You have my thanks for all you have done to help the League Club and to help Kieran. Once you became champion, Kieran withdrew himself entirely from our ranking system. Though I consider this someone sad, it is not as if he and I can no longer meet. More than anything, I am glad he seems to be acting like his former self once more. Indeed, I have been swept up in joy to such an extent that I have prepared a tremendous amount of the flight-enabling supplement used in my trial. Please feed your Agias an appropriate portion of it whenever you wish to fly. Gias! Jump, jump. You want to fly right now? Please slow down. The supplement was never meant to be eaten in such large. Yeah. Let's go. He can just fly. It would seem he is powered up somehow. From the looks of it, I would guess that it has gained the power to fly whenever you wish it to. I suppose this is an acceptable outcome. There is a super hard course for my flying time trial. You may attempt it upon clearing the hard course. Feel free to do so when you are ready. Okay. Pretty good, pretty good. Thanks for the tip, Dave. Nibble, now that I have 3,000 points, I know what I'm about to do. Fly up to the core now? I will. I don't care about this guy. This is important. 
Okay, I almost leveled up the wrong thing. I just assumed that it was gonna be in the coastal biome. It's in the savanna biome. Woo! Whatever, whatever. We've got more important things to do. Yeah, I love it here. Special coaches? Yeah, I got tons of friends. They can all come over. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. Speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. We're on a time limit. $200? Oh, baby. Nibble, thank you so much for all of your points. <laughs> all of your hard work today. The secret boss of Blueberry Academy? The one who summons the greatest number of guest coaches to our fine house of learning using BP will earn the right to challenge Blueberry Academy's beloved secret boss? Saffron. Savannah biome. Charmander! Hooray! That's not who we care about. Charmander! Where is he? Where is my catcher? Where did he go? Why does this keep happening to me? There he is. This is not correct. You should not be here. We gotta go. We gotta catch Totodile. We gotta complete the speed run. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, you know what? Ha, ah, stay away from me. I'm just gonna have a run around and see really quick. Maybe in this cleaner water. Muddy water? What a great move. Oh, it's just the light. Oh my god, that scared me. Yeah, I bet he'll be really rare. Mandibuzz? Alright, alright. Ah, 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 stay away from me. Get back. Nibble, would you like to join me for my picnic? What a handsome bunch, eh? What are you guys thinking? Nibble. He's here. Oh, 
Oh, he's dead. <laughs> he was on the table. How do we make a four-star sandwich? I think we just... I think we just send it, okay? Let me find something with a water encounter. Nope. Uh, nope. That's fighting. Oh, I can't go back now. Okay. Jamie, can you give me a five minute warning from before we have to leave? What salmon did you pick? Uh, it was like encounter power water. Hold on. There's a number for it. Um. Number 56. You ready to go? Um. No, I'm asking for a five minute warning for when we need to go. <laughs> I, yeah, like, I... I, I just need to put my jeans on and then I'll be ready to go. Okay. Hurry, Nibble. We need to make the greatest sandwich of our life. Evenly spaced, look at you. I'll let you know when it's 10 to 1. Alright. See? I knew that would happen. This is why you never put the top on. Amazing. Gulp it down, Nibble. Spicy. Yeah. We just need to make it together and then that makes it four stars. It's perfect. Nibble, you'd actually better disconnect. Because I might have to just leave. Thank you so much for all your help. Look, Sobble! Sobble! Yes, yes, come here! Sure, I'll fly up to the core in a minute, after I catch Totodile. Oh shit. I didn't want it in a quick ball anyway. We can put them in whatever we want. Uh-oh.
There we go. Hooray! Mole! With the whooper watch? Welcome in, Mole. Good to see you. Oh, there's like three more over there. Totodile, where are you? Charmander. Um, hello. I guess we already have like a million Charmander, but whatever. Chance to get a shiny. There we go. What's up, dude? Mole, well, we're not streaming for very much longer. We've got a previous engagement. We're going to a birthday party. But I'm seeing if I can't get Totodile before the end. There's another, um, mud- oh fuck. Yeah, my party. <laughs> Hi, Asti. Ah, leave me alone! I've got just like the slightest delay on my controller and I always just barely run into the guys. Let's try over here. It's a party for- Ah, go away! Tabitha is now a girl. Audio jungle. Audio jungle. Can't they see I'm trying to do something important here? What's that? <gasps> there he is! The boy himself. He's here! Um, luxury ball. Shit. Team Totodile! Hit me with the hydro pump! Bro. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, good. Come on. Because he's a treasure, he deserves to go in the beautiful ball. Totodile speed run complete! We have done it! Team Toto is satisfied. The blood pact is complete. Two hours, 19 minutes, world record. Hooray! Hell yeah, Squirtle. Are you fucking serious? Get out of my face. Get out of my goddamn face right this instant. Let's see him. Relaxed. Alright, guys. 
that's gonna be it for me today. Don't end? I have to. I gotta go. Someone raid in. Nope. We gotta go. Thanks so much, everybody. Uh, we can raid someone. In the stream on top of the terror court. I can't. I literally can't. I have to go right now. Never mind. Sorry, Dave. All right, everybody. Thank you so much. Adobo is live. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, don't forget to check out uh, the Discord and the uh, uh, the YouTube where I upload the VODs. I gotta go right now. The birthday is canceled. Oh, uh, yeah. Sorry. It's not. Love you heaps. Thank you so much for being here today. Thank you for the VOD watchers. Don't forget to follow the channel. Um, yeah, check out the raid message. Hope you can, I hope you can rest. Thank you, Rodrigo. Thank you so much for all the followers today. I'll see you guys later. Maybe I'll stream later. Tonight. We'll see. Okay, bye. Love yous. <laughs>